Yeah, they're weird. They're so big and spongy. Let me get more video up here. You want to take one with you? I don't know, maybe. This one's loose. <laughs> it's just rolled right loose. You're right, they're not in the ground at all. There's like a little little stem. Yeah. No, it's not even that. His nose is right in the back of your foot. That is so wild. It's just a ball. <laughs> you gotta be careful how you pick it up, otherwise you'll... You got me put it in the bag, you take it with you? Yeah, I'll take it, huh? Yes. Get a bag out there, honey. Get a bag. <laughs> Just want to get a soda can for reference. See where you put your thumb through it. <laughs> ah, ew, it's gross in there. Okay. Looks like a giant marshmallow. Watch your knife, Bob. Uh, it's moist. Yeah, very moist. I'm like getting the sun. Wow. <laughs> Oh, oh, it's so gross. <laughs> really? Your fingers get wet when you oh, touch it. Dear. <laughs> Hopefully, it's not poisonous. <laughs> so, here we go standard baseball, standard softball, standard basketball, giant puffball. So, yeah, according to Google, this is a Michigan puffball. Uh, these things are huge. Found this in my dad's yard. Again, for reference. And apparently, they're most likely edible. Although, you can possibly find ones that aren't, so I'm not going to eat it. But they are, according to Google, they're, they reach soccer ball size or bigger. 4 to 30 inches and bigger. But if they're yellowish on the inside or brown, then it's not edible. But anyways, I'm going to cut this thing open. We cut one open at my dad's house. I'm going to cut this one open. See what we got. Knife doesn't reach across. giant sponge. Oh, it is yellow. The other one was completely white on the inside. It is so spongy and wet. Your fingers get physically wet when you poke this. Ooh. That thing is amazing. Well, I thought they were very interesting. Hope you enjoyed this video.